Do you want to learn how to create a group policy? I will take you through the process step by step in this tutorial video. To learn how, don't go anywhere. Hi, I'm Patrick from Dutchie Tech Tips. If you want more tutorial videos like this, hit the subscribe button. If you're already subscribed, hit the bell icon to receive notifications for future videos. To create a group policy in Server 2016, we need to have our group policy management MMC Snap-in open. Once you have group policy management open, we need to go to group policy objects. Because we have not created group policies on this server before, you will find two default group policies already available on the server. The first one is default domain controllers policy, which will be in the domain controllers organizational unit, which will be applied to any domain controller in the domain. The next one will be default domain policy, which will be applied to the entire domain. To create a group policy, we need to right click inside the contents window. A context menu will appear and we need to select new. Once you have done that, a pop-up window will appear called new GPO. GPO stands for group policy object. Now it's asking us for two pieces of information, the name and source starter GPO. Source starter GPO is used for templates. If you create templates in the starter GPO, you can use them and those template configurations will be transferred to your new group policy object. So we don't have any of those at this time. So we're going to give our group policy a name. So we're going to call it Orb Global Policy. Once you have done that, click OK. As you can see that the org global policy is created successfully and is now ready to be used in our domain. To summarize the key point of this video, I have shown you how easy it is to create a group policy object in Windows Server 2016.